remain Honorable Osai Nicholas Osai. I represent the local Kwani Federal Constituency of Delta State. Mr. Speaker, I have a matter of urgent public importance. As usual, relying on the aid and all relevant rules of this great Honorable House to bring in a matter of urgent public importance on the subject matter and urgent need to stop the illegality in the Niger Data Development Commission. I think that is the subject matter. Mr. Speaker, I move that all relevant rules of this House be suspended to enable me to bring this matter. I so move, Mr. Speaker. Well, we take this uh, motion now, suspend our rules, and take the motion now. Please say aye. Those against, please say nay. Ayes have it. Honorable Sir. is the urgent need to stop the illegality in the Niger Data Development Commission. The House notes that one of the core mandates for the establishment of the Niger Data Development Commission is the implementation of the set rules and regulation projects and programs for the sustainable development of the Niger Data area. The House also notes, Mr. Speaker, distinguished honorable colleagues, that the law establishing the Commission provides in Section 8 of NDDC Act that its management and administrative instructive shall be the responsibility of its governing board. A further note, Mr. Speaker, distinguished honorable colleagues, that the governing board of the commissions includes chairman, the managing director, the executive directors, and the other members with power to manage and supervise the affairs of the commission and make rules and regulations for effective functioning of the commission. Mr. Speaker, you are aware that in the month of October uh, 2019, Mr. President ordered for a forensic audit of the operations and activity of NDDC from 2001 to 2019, which is in line with what the House of Representatives has already done. Rules that you can only speak from your allocated seat. So we shouldn't uh, laugh over that point. Over. It's written there in black and white. So, Honorable, uh, 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 sorry? Hmm? The minority leader, what? I, I, I think the, I think the, I think the, so in other words, you are, you are the minority leader in acting capacity? Is that what you're saying? Are you the minority leader in acting capacity? Eh? Under what authority? No, no, that cannot be. That cannot be. There's enough seats there to, 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 for the minority leadership to, to handle. Honorable Sai, please go, you can move your motion from your seat. Don't worry. That seat, that seat right now is too hot to occupy. <laughs> Point of order sustained. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, distinguished honorable colleagues. I think it's good that the rule, our rules should be obeyed. And I quite appreciate the honorable members who have raised this issue. That formed a part of a tradition of this house now and a precedence. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Thank you, my honorable colleagues. I say you are aware, Mr. Speaker, distinguished honorable colleagues, that in the later part of October 2019, precisely on the 29th, Mr. President, through the office of the Secretary to the Federation, announced the appointment of 15 new NDDC board members whose names were thereafter sent to the Senate for confirmation. Honorable Dr. Okay, you are welcome. The storm, Mr. Speaker, distinguished honorable colleagues. Now, in the evening of same 29th, October 2019, and to the utter consternation of all Nigerians, the Minister of Niger Delta Affairs, Senator Goswil Apabi, brazenly announced in channel television the sacking of the acting managing director of NDDC and the appointment of a three man. Interim Management Committee, which he directed to manage, run the affairs of NDDC for the next six months. And for that, aware, Mr. Speaker, distinguished honorable colleagues, that shortly after the appointment of the three-man Interim Management Committee, 
The Senate confirmed the 15 NDDC board members sent to it by Mr. President and in fulfillment of NDDC Act. Worried, Mr. Speaker, distinguished honorable colleagues, that the speed and curiosity with which the Minister of Niger Data Affairs hurriedly set up a three-man interim management committee is stunning and suspicious. Acknowledge, Mr. Speaker, distinguished honorable colleagues, the fact that in practice, any existing vacancies in the office of the managing director of NDDC is usually filled temporarily by the highest directors in the order of seniority and ranking. Suffice, Mr. Speaker, distinguished honorable colleagues, to say that by the confirmation of NDDC governing board member by the Senate, the three man interim management committee of the NDDC recently set up by the Minister of Niger Data Affairs becomes vitiated. No, I'm void of no legal effect. Resolve, Mr. Speaker, distinguished honorable colleagues, to urge the ministers of the Niger Delta Affairs to withdraw the appointment and the activities of the three man interim management committee that is unknown to NDDC Act. Urge this honorable house as before, because the house have come into an occasion like this before. Both in seventh and eighth assembly, Mr. Speaker was also a principal officer at that time. Urge the House of Representatives and the Senate to discontinue 2020 appropriation and budget process of the Minister of Niger Data Affairs until the Minister of Niger Data Affairs complies with the resolution number one. And urge the committee on legislative compliance to implement same. I so move. Thank you. Um, Honorable Osai, uh, this motion, I, I, uh, the points are well taken. Uh, I think rather than going to a debate, I think we should send it to the committee to investigate the issues that you have raised. Because so far, what I, because I've heard a lot about these things too, but all I've heard uh, from pages of newspapers, from TV reports, I cannot verify certain facts, or we cannot verify certain facts. And um, I, the, the Senate that swore in the, that confirmed rather, the board, have not, um, I'm not aware of any issue that they have brought up concerning this. Uh, they will be in a better position to know what's going on. But nonetheless, I believe the, 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 the issues that you have raised are very germane, particularly if they're in contravention of the law. And so rather than us running to a situation where we debate things we're not properly seized of, facts that we're not properly seized of, um, I think it's proper to send it to the committee on NDDC to investigate the matter and report to us. Uh, 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 the committee should report because the issues are very salient. Should report to us within a week. Matter referred to committee on NDC. Thank you. 